off. Good afternoon from Stramra, the Scotland on the west coast. Where apparently it's meant to be a pretty rough, ropey town, according to a lot of people in Scotland, that is. People who I know. Now it took me about six hours to get here, so I'm desperate for a pint. So I'm definitely gonna be getting some beers in. It's about five o'clock, so pubs will be a bit busier. I'm gonna mooch about, see what's kicking off in Stramra. This is where you can get like a ferry to uh, Belfast. Don't know if it goes other places, Dublin maybe. Who knows? Uh, one time, don't bring my sunglasses because every time I come to Scotland, it's uh, it's cloudy. But look at it, absolutely banging weather. So we're going to get into the centre, mooch about, get to some pubs, and get a well-earned Guinness after a six slash seven-hour drive. So see what's kicking off, eh? It's drum right. Well, I don't know if that's open or not, but straight away, that's a contender for later on. Doesn't really look open, but it's hard to tell these days. I don't know what makes Stramra rough. I don't know if it's a housing situation, the people who live here, uh, or there's just nought to do here. I don't know. So that's what we're going to find out as we mooch about towards the town centre, eh? So it's just a town centre in front of me. I'm hoping this just ain't it. Now there's a bit more. I can see the car factory down here. See a card factory or a CEX, you know you're right in the centre then. Or a Greg's. If you were. Uh, Empty lots about. Tell you what, it's not as bad as when I went to air, which ain't too far from here. Don't know if it's north or south from here, can't remember. Might be north, but that was hanging. A lot bigger though. I had like spoons, don't know if this has got a spoon to doubt it, but that air was hanging. And when I went there, it was sunny as well. So it's not like the weather made it feel grim. But yeah, we'll keep mooching, check out the air. Check out housing situation. Public house that's gone. Also that Reggie's bar that's gone. I think it's kind of critical of pubs closing down because it's uh it's everywhere you see. City centre, London, stuff like that. A lot of them are shut, which is what it is I suppose. Town centres, just there. See these houses about a minute away. Great name for a pub. The pub. The thing is, with this town, I feel like not many people will say, let's go Stramra. It's not really a place you come to, it's like a day out. Like I say, you've got the uh, ferries going to Belfast, that's why a lot of people come here, get the ferry across, a lot of trucks and stuff like that. It was like a day out. Can't see many people mooching here from, uh, like I say, an hour away and stuff like that. Chasers. Sounds like it's open late. Sounds booming already, it's about six o'clock. But I can't do 2 a.m. stuff anymore. Just turned 30. You know what I mean? Two o'clock in the morning. 
Jaeger bombs, loud music, definitely not for me that. Hey, what's that over there? Maybe some fish and chips or something like that, but I'm going to get to a pub now because I saw a little uh, cheeky small little pub down there, so let's go see what's kicking off there, eh? There we go, six o'clock, time for a beer. There it is. Let's give it a go, eh? Alright, so have ten minutes please, Paul. Nice one. Yes, my senior there you go, £3.50 tenants. Football's on, Euros. Do like tenants, me. Might stick on Scottish beers today, but considering it's quite close to Belfast. You know, Guinness might come over on the ferry, so it hasn't travelled far, so it might be decent here. So if you see Guinness and it's flowing in the pub, you might get one. Cross Keys, it's like that pub, proper locals, locals pub. But I feel like this town, everywhere's going to be a local, locals pub. So, on to the next one. Don't know where it is, there's one here actually. Don't know if that's open. But there's a few around, they all look quite unique as well, so uh, yeah, let's see if we can get any more Scottish beers on, try and get onto like a Scottish stout or something. Let's give it a go. The thing is that annoys me, it's not Scotland, is you get these, so Scottish currency. Obviously up here, because you're in Scotland, which is fine. But when you go back to England, no one likes to take them, which is really annoying. Because it's, it's currency at the end of the day. But um, but yeah, you go into any corner shop, even some bars, they just don't accept them. Which is uh, really annoying, so it's pretty hard to shift when you get back down to uh, England. But it's what it is, hopefully I'll spend it all tonight. So I've just got my coppers, which is normal sterling. But yeah, next one's the grapes. Somewhere down here. Let's move before I get run over. I think it's where that Belhaven best sign is which is another Scottish beer. Ah. Oh yeah, here it is. The grapes. Jesus, is that open? Door's open. Yeah, there we go. It's getting there, eh? Is it in the queue ends? I'll give that a go then, please. Please, yeah. Perfect, thank you. Where's that from? Is that Scotland? Scottish? Oh, it is. Oh, cheers. All right, thank you. Let's give it a go, eh? Mate, I've got halfway through this pint. Struggling. Not that strong, it's just the um, taste gets to you a bit. It's quite uh, coffee slash chocolatey. But booze is alright. There you go, the grapes. Um, it's alright, pub that to be fair. Got a bit of selection on tap. The grapes. Don't know what time it's open till, but it's pretty lively in there. Next one, I've just seen it on uh, Google Maps. Wasn't going to go to it, but when I uh, zoomed in outside, it looks pretty tasty. So when I mooch down there, two minute walk, let's see what that's like, eh? Oh, it's meant to be just down here, but it looks a bit sketchy, this alleyway. 
That's not it. Don't know. Round the corner here or something. Yeah, here it is. The corner pocket. Just down here on the left. Let's give it a go, eh? Dead in here. Oh, well. Hey, um, let's have a Guinness, please. Yeah. Thank you. Any other room sitting? Those are just all here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah just here. Yeah. No worries. There it is. Don't look too bad. Here we go. Six out of ten. No, about five. Bro. Probably just because I've been to Belfast recently. Probably dead in it. It's not the. Uh, I ain't got much personality either. Corner pocket. Um. Yeah. Pretty dead in there. It says it's open till one, so I'm guessing it boots off later on. A lot of young people in there. Uh, like I say, I'm only 30, but the young people in there, they look about 18. They feel like kids to me nowadays. Um, so that's probably why it was dead. Probably boots off later on. I don't know what's kicking off down there. Um, I was going to leave it there, but I can't leave on that pub. Because uh, I don't feel like it was great. So I'm going to go to another one. Because uh, I don't feel happy being in that one. And uh, you guys probably don't feel happy about seeing that one. And the Guinness wasn't great. So, one more. The pub. The one we saw before. Called the pub. Get in there. Get a pint. Hopefully it's better than that. Let's go. More like it. This is more like it. <laughs> There you go, look at that. Can't touch that for a bit though first. Yeah, it's a banging pub in here, band setting up. Atmosphere is good. Guinness looks all right. The last one did to be fair, so I'll give it a taste test. But yeah, it's all right. There you go, settled now. Probably a bit too much of a head, but let's give it a go. Give it a go, eh? It's only better than, it's only slightly better than the other one. About seven out of ten, six and a half. Is what it is though, but at least the booze is alright. <laughs> go that's the pub anyway so I'm gonna end it there because I've got to be driving tomorrow and in Scotland you can't even have one beer and drive so I've had four pints now get to bed wake up fresh-ish well now nah, wake up fresh it's only four pints and then uh, hit the road onto either Edinburgh or Glasgow but yeah that's strong rare anyway what I've seen anyway just the center that is I don't really explore the outskirts because it's not what you get on this channel. But, 
the actual area it's a bit it's a bit run down to be fair there isn't much going on which is the same with a lot of scottish sort of small towns not many people venture there for like tourism and stuff like that but the pubs itself are really decent like I say that was kicking off there the one i went in before was going to be kicking off a bit more later on a bit more lively um i wish i could stay out but it is what it is i suppose so yeah ashton ra next one is going to be either glasgow or edinburgh um done a six hour drive today to get to edinburgh it's going to be about four hours so uh i might just go to glasgow depends how i wake up but yeah so yeah that's that's Stram Ra. Uh, there you go so yeah i'll catch you in the next one whether it's glasgow or edinburgh so yeah i'll see you in the next one